So I'm gonna show you a crypto trading strategy that can make you a crypto millionaire guaranteed. And I know that's a bold promise and a lot of you are gonna to come to this video and comment down in the section below without even watching the video telling me, eh, it's impossible, nothing in life is guaranteed, especially crypto, eh, 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 and all that crap. But maybe watch the video, evaluate it, then talk about it. That would be the smart thing to do. Of course, that's too much to ask in today's age. But anyway, let's get into it. So before we start, let me actually tell you why I'm making this video and what it's all about. What I'm trying to do is give you a blueprint of what you can do as a trader so you can actually trade your way to a million dollars. But do understand that a lot of this depends on how much technical analysis you know, how much you understand about fundamentals, how much research you put in, and so on and that's not what this video is about. This video will give you a blueprint, if you will, so you understand how to manage portfolios and how you can make it work in your favor. L let me show you what I mean. So the first thing you need to understand is your time horizon. You have to understand that this is a year's process, well not one year, but many years process. So your first two years in crypto is gonna be your survival mode. What do I mean by survival mode? It means you're gonna fall victim to scams, to pump and dump groups, to a whole bunch of stuff that you, that's gonna make you lose your money. And you're probably in this category if you bought the top recently or if you didn't take profits. Now, if you stick this out for about five years, which ironically is close to uh, a cycle, a cryptocurrency cycle, then you can actually make enough money to actually become a millionaire. And by making enough money, I mean making your first few hundred thousand dollars or so. And, and yes, that's quite possible and not hard to do in crypto as long as you follow some key concepts and and not screw up. Now I'm gonna show you my portfolio strategy and exactly how I trade in just a minute, but let me tell you a few things that you need to know so there's no misunderstanding here. You have to work hard, and what working hard means you're not watching YouTube videos for hours and hours and crypto news saying you're working hard. You're not, that's just wasting time. Working hard means you're learning how to do your own research, for example. You're learning TA. You're actually putting time into this so you can learn. And this is not a five to nine job. This does take many, many hours to actually learn. Now that does not mean you cannot make a lot of money in crypto if you don't have this time or don't wanna put the time in, but A, you might lose that money, and B, you won't become a crypto millionaire. It's just how it is. You have to put the time in and the effort in. Now the other thing you need to understand is you also have to work on you. What do I mean by working on you? You need to level up so you, as a person, can scale. That would be reading books, for example, watching seminars. And this can be self-help, it can be acquiring new skill sets, it, it doesn't really matter. What it means is you need to be able to work on yourself so you can grow as a person and go to the next level. And that's why I made this playlist on the mindset you need to become a crypto millionaire. So make sure you subscribe down below and hit the bell notification button so you don't miss the next videos. Now let's get into the trading strategy so you can understand how this works and how to trade. Now I'm gonna show you this with three portfolios. Even though I use more, I'm gonna show you for simplicity three portfolios and how to trade them. Your first portfolio is your HODL portfolio. Your second portfolio is mid to long term portfolio. A little end there kind of escaped looks like mid-log. And your third is your trading portfolio or your moonshot portfolio if you want or call it whatever you really want. Now when you start in cryptocurrency, your goal is to start in the middle here. Whether you're starting at the top of the market, whether you're starting at the bottom, the mid to long term portfolio is when you want to add assets. And what you want to be adding is what I like to call blue chip cryptocurrencies. Things like Bitcoin, things like Ethereum, arguably Atom, and so on. 
And all you need to do is accumulate here. Whether it goes up or down doesn't really matter. You want to accumulate. Chances are you bought the top, it's gonna to take you a little longer, but if you're buying now, for example, it's actually a good time. And yes, if you know TA here, if you know how to buy swing lows and so on, it's a lot easier. I'm just giving you the blueprint, the fundamentals here. Now, as you start making profits, as these go up in value, you wanna take some of those profits and add them to your your HODL position, especially in Bitcoin. But this HODL position here, you're not gonna touch for the next five, 10 years. The basic rule is you become rich with altcoins, but you become wealthy accumulating Bitcoin. Does that make sense? You can also add some Ethereum here, for example, or you can take profits from Atom, let's say, for example, put them in Bitcoin, and then put some Bitcoin into your HODL position. Of course, you wanna also take some stable coins and keep them on the side so you can buy massive dips because once you're in a bull run, you have to understand that these dips, they go down maybe 40%, but they don't last, it keeps on going up in trend. That's when you buy so you can accumulate more. So you need that dry powder. Also, you can take this in dollars and live if you want. So you can actually make money this way, which is pretty much what I do. Now, as it's confirmed that we're in a bull run, that's when everything is going up like crazy here. You don't just take profits in your huddle position, you also start gambling, so to speak, with low cap coins. This is when you start getting into other projects. And yes, you might buy them higher than other people, but you still have that 10x, 100x, even 1000x potential without the risk. And then what you do here, you move your profits and initial investment if possible over time into the middle portfolio. And then from the middle portfolio, you move to your HODL portfolio. See, if you do it this way, it's pretty much full proof. You will make money, you will accumulate Bitcoin, you will accumulate USDC, and you can never get burnt because you keep on taking profits along the way. And then even if the bear market hits where you don't expect, you still have profit so you can actually live from this, but you also have Bitcoin, maybe Ethereum in your huddle position, keeping you exposed to the cryptocurrency markets and not going in with FOMO, with panic and so on. You just wait for the next cycle. It's all about cycles. Does that make sense? Now, there is one more thing. You have to understand that this is a game. It's a numbers game. And it's actually quite simple. Finding your 100x, 1000x coin, that's not exactly the way to do it. If you want to really become a crypto millionaire, you have to know the numbers game. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to link a video right here. Watch this video next. This is the numbers game. Or watch this video right here. Make sure you subscribe down below and I will see you in the next video.